Edwin here. So we're in the SRT motherfucker. We're about to paint the calipers red. Or my boy right here. Alright. Say what's up to the vlog. Boy, tell them what we're about to get done to the SRT motherfucker. About to paint the brake caliper. What color are you finna paint them red? Yeah. Oh shit. New bottle of red. Alright, so yeah, let's get to it. First things first, before you lift up the car or do anything else, make sure to loosen up all five lug nuts of your car. So that way, when we get the car lifted, it will be easier to take off the wheel. All right, next thing, you gotta slide the jack under the car, locate your jack points and put it right there. Next thing, you know, start lifting up your jack. If you don't know exactly where to jack up your car, you can always Google jack points and stuff. That's what I did, because personally, this is this is my car. This is my girlfriend's car. But yeah, so, you know, just Google it or look at the owner's manual. It'll tell you exactly where to put the jack and jack up your car. Make sure to double check before, as you can see, we were looking under the car, making sure nothing was moving or everything was in its right spot. Next step, you know, remove your tire after you loosened up your lug nuts and took them off. And boom, there's the caliper. Alright, then you gotta start cleaning up the brake caliper with brake cleaner because all the dirt, rocks, everything that goes on it, the brake dust, all that stuff, if you paint over it directly, it's gonna be 
weird and sticky and stuff. You don't want that. You want your brake calipers to look like almost factory with the paint. I had to clean it again, but make sure you clean it again with the towel. Wipe it off. Wipe it off real good. The better you wipe, the better paint you'll, better paint results you'll get. Thing you want to do is put over uh, any like little Walmart bag, store bag over the rotor so it won't get paint on it and you know makes everything easier a little piece of tape right there to secure everything in its place you know make sure everything looks good and good and right and then I put a piece of paper over the strut so no paint will get on that either I don't know if you guys can hear but my MacBook's about to blow up anyways all right now you may start painting i got the dupli color caliper paint from autozone which was like ten dollars you know nothing too crazy so yeah and right here i took off some of the paint with the brake cleaner because it was like leaving like little like bumps on the paint and stuff and it looked weird and that was because i didn't clean it off right the first time so yeah make sure to clean it up right like i said clean it up right the more you clean it the better it'll look and here i go re-spraying it now, immediately you can tell you know it's first coat it's getting red already you know, nothing too crazy it's easy fast you can already tell the difference and I mean right here I'm getting the back angle one or two coats and it's straight I did all four wheels with one bottle and the bottle was ten dollars so you know it's better than buying um, caliper covers or getting like new calibers which are like hundreds of dollars so yeah this is really a cheap and affordable way to make a car look better look more sporty i guess please don't do it on four cylinder cars though it doesn't work i promise you it doesn't. and here i take off the paper bag i only did two coats you know that's all i really needed as you can see the calipers are bright red you know no spills no drip no nothing make sure when you're painting it though don't hold the bottle at a like don't hold it at one spot make sure you like swiping it up and down and stuff so yeah that's to avoid drifting here i go rolling back the tire putting it back on the wheel and yeah you can see the red caliper looks great on the black challenger right there boom like new it looks like it came like that originally so yeah same thing with the back you know take off the back wheel jack it up from the back obviously but yeah you know stuff pretty self-explanatory do the same thing, clean it up real good with the brake caliper. Brake caliper. Brake cleaner. <clears throat> My bad. And as you can see, look at all that dirt that I'm cleaning off of it. I made sure to clean this one a little bit better because the first one, you know, I was trying to do it quick. It was nighttime too. We were just lighting up the we were just lighting up the car with like a bunch of work lights, construction work lights and things like that. So yeah, that's why it looks well lit. I go you know putting the Walmart bag covering every little spot as you can see I'm tucking it in everywhere so the rotor won't get paint on it I mean and if it does you can really clean it off with brake cleaner but you know I want to avoid all that hassle and stuff so yeah same thing I did on the other side wrap the bag around you know clean it off put I put a little piece of newspaper on the strut so it wouldn't get paint so I wouldn't drip paint on it and yeah, I mean, other than that, you know, just do the same thing you did on the front caliper. There's really, that's all there is to it, really. You know, get all the angles. Make sure to get underneath. That's a lot of places people forget because, you know, you don't really see underneath. You, know, you gotta get underneath, too. And yeah. And also, like I said, if you get, like, any spots on places you don't want paint to be, you can always just remove it with brake cleaner. After the first coat, you can already tell the difference. Right there, look, I sprayed it on the flat thing but yeah I, did, I just went over it with a second coat and made it look nice and shiny yes sir 
And once you're done painting, you know, remove the bag and look at the final results, man. Them calipers look amazing. That red with the black rim is gonna stick out. I'm just showing off how there's no paint drip in between the cracks because I tucked in the bag. Good. So, yeah. That's really there is to it, man. You know, just put your wheel back on and you're done. That's how to paint your calipers. Thank you guys for watching.